I'm Brigham Larson with Brigham Larson Pianos. This is a 1990 Samick that uh, is in very, very good condition. We didn't do anything to, to it on the outside. It, uh, it was already in, in pretty good condition. There's some small, some small blemishes, but uh, nothing, uh, nothing terrible, nothing anywhere near what we've dealt with in the past. It does have a matching bench, which actually is pretty uncommon to have a matching bench. You can see the legs, the legs match perfectly to the, to the legs of the bench and the piano. So um, Samic, Samic is one of those, it's a, it's a Korean brand and it's one of those brands that, uh, that they, that is, I would characterize as good. It, uh, it's not, it's not problematic. It's maybe um, kind of middle of the road and and I've worked on tons and tons of them over the years and they're just they're just reliable workhorse pianos that don't um, cause many problems they just last a long time and just go and go and go and this piano is 44 inches which is which is not bad it uh, it's kind of a good a good living room piano a really good piano for um, for like an intermediate student by the time a student is advanced they need a, a grand piano, something, something a little bit more responsive, bigger, um, more nuanced, but for an inter, be obviously, obviously a beginning piano, this would be more than sufficient, even an intermediate, like I said a minute ago, this, this piano would be a great option. And then, uh, value wise, we are, we're about half of what, of what this piano, uh, would be if it were brand new and it's, and, and is it brand new? No, but it's, it's in, it's in, probably I'd, I'd say a minus condition overall so so I, I think from a value perspective this, this is a really good piano and it has uh, has this this middle pedal that quiets it down significantly probably more than half cuts the decibel level more than half okay sound wise like tone piano is this piano is more uh, bright pretty crisp That's good. Good little piano. Come, uh, come check it out. See what you think. And if you're watching this this video from out of state, we do lots of uh, long distance moving. A lot of people 
think that a pia because a piano is so heavy i mean it's like five hundred pounds that it's not feasible to move a piano a long distance but that's something that we do on a regular basis and it's surprisingly reasonable just last month alone there's a moving company that we that we had move fourteen pianos i mean it's it's uh, all the way from Massachusetts was the furthest east that he went, in California and, and Ohio and, let's see, Texas. He went all over. So, uh, so that's, it's, it's totally feasible, doable thing to do. Um, yeah. If, uh, but if you're local, come check it out. Try it in person. Thanks for watching.